Hello everybody, my name is Internet Kutera and today is the day to remember George Michaels from if you guys are girls are familiar with him, he's one of the members of um the Wham because I know most of you girls I got uh, uh, guys and girls out there know that them from Deadpool. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> but um yeah, but um today is the day that we were re honored and um dedicate to him since he passed away I mean, he did. He he didn't recently pass away, but this is like a day to honor him because two years ago he died in two, December twenty fifth, two thousand sixteen, on Christmas Day, which is like the scariest thing to ever wake up on Christmas Day. Around it, when you're dead, when you're dead by it, and Christmas Day and any holidays, that's like the saddest and the scariest. But in in if an unexpected death to occur, that's like the saddest. And the age of his death was fifty three, I believe. And so far, the cause of death is so far unknown yet. So far, because so far I'm looking at some of the reports are some of the manager reported it's he he got so far he had a heart failure. But I searched, it, but I found out that I believe his cause of death was a fatty liver disease. I could be wrong, but his cause of death is so far unknown yet. But we will get that. Uh, we will get that soon. Maybe who knows? We will. But um, George Michaels made so many popular songs that we already are familiar with, which is Wake Me Up Before You Go-Go, and um, Everything She Wants, Careless Whisper, Faith, Last Christmas, that's that's one of the Christmas songs I listen to. And so many good songs that he made, and he died away at such a young age of 53. That's sad. So yeah, today is, not only today is Christmas Day, but today is also going to be a day to tribute George Michaels from the member... Of Wham, and it's so sad that he died in Christmas Day. That's like the scariest thing to happen. And since he died in Christmas Day in 2016, for now on, whenever Christmas Day arrives, I will always remember George Michaels, no matter what. Because since his death occurred in 2016 in December 25th, that's what really str surprised me the most. Because it was in the holiday too, one of the happiest holiday of all times. And by for now on, whenever we hit to Christmas Day, I will always remember George Michael's cause of death. Like I will admit, I will always look back on George Michael of, of the way of today. We'll be honoring to George Michael. Darn, he passed away at such a young age of fifty three. That's sad. And I have no words. I'm completely speechless just of how sad and how scary it is to die on Christmas Day. But yeah, like I make a promise from now on, I will always remember George Michaels today just to honor him by listening to his music. The most popular ones and I definitely need to get into his underrated songs. So that will prove that I'm a fan of George Michaels. Because, I mean, I've listened to some of the songs. I'm not big. I'm not a biggest fan of George Michaels. I, just saw, I, I heard most of his songs. I mean, how can you not? But, um... I've heard like pretty much seven or six songs from him. So far, I, I need to get into George Michael's music. So, today is not only Christmas Day, but today is to honor George Michael's. Because I know that if George Michael's is watching me, I he will be proud of me for honoring his, um, you know, honoring his legacy. Just to, um, just to tribute, this is just like a tribute to George Michael's, you know, since he made so many great songs he made over the past in the 80s through the 2000 era. Something like that. He makes really good music. I, I suggest you check it out. Because if you're not much of a Wham fan. If you're not like a big Wham fan. Or nothing like that. Go ahead and, go ahead and listen to Wham music. And George Michael. If you're watching this. I just want to let you know. I love you man. I love you at the bottom of our everybody's hearts. Of how great you make so many good music. And you... Like I say, like what every thing, everybody says, when they're every, when they're gone, but they will never be forgotten as one of the greatest singers in the '80s, right there. And and that's the thing. That's the thing I learned from my parents or my dad is that um, I learned it from my dad that when they when uh, when everybody does uh, when you listen to a singer that passed away, that means that you're making that means that when you listen to the music, their legacy will go on. And and your mus and that means that their musics are immortal. They're they're whenever you listen to their musics, 
That means that they're immortal no matter what. That do, that means that they're they're immortal, like you know what I mean? Cause like that doesn't mean their songs are gone forever. That means that you're you're keeping their legacy alive and you're at least you're making them immortal because because when they're dead, then you're at least listening to something to honor by, you know? And this is just a video, just a tribute to George Michaels, a singer from Wham, who makes really good songs over the over the years. Passed away at the age of 53, and I'm guessing the cause of death was a fatty liver disease. I'm guessing, but I don't know. Leave me in the comments down below. What was the cause of death of um? What was the cause of death for George Michaels? Cause I I really want to know. But um, yeah. If you guys and girls enjoyed the video or my trip, or if you guys and girls enjoyed the tributing to George Michaels. Like, comment, subscribe, share this video with your friends or family. Um, my social media are in the description as always. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. And also, change the world.